A former Milwaukee County Children's Court judge sentenced to nine years in prison on federal child pornography charges. Fox 6's Bill Miston was in the courtroom. I think it was a fair sentence, to put it bluntly. Brett Blummy appearing before a federal judge in a Madison courtroom Wednesday for sentencing after pleading guilty to child porn charges. Blummy said his addictions to child pornography and alcohol stemmed from being a closeted gay man growing up and the pandemic contributing to his actions, saying, I was filling my emptiness with these images and videos in an attempt to make myself whole, and it did not work. Chief Judge James Peterson questioning Blummy's explanation, pointing to documented instances of his interest in young boys, saying, this isn't a momentary darkness caused by the pandemic. I just don't think it's an adequate explanation. In an unusual step, the head of the state's court system speaking, saying Blummy's use of the children's court internet to commit the crimes left an indelible stain on the courthouse. He was in a position of trust, being a children's court judge to make decisions about children many of whom had been abused or neglected. Judge Peterson agreeing, but noting the crimes were not ones of judicial misconduct, such as taking a bribe to fix a case, but a stain on the judiciary. Prosecutors recommended more than a decade in prison, Peterson departing downward slightly, ordering nine years. He wants to remake his life in a way that does not in any way put him in a situation again where he would end up falling victim to his own deviant interests. Prosecutors declined to comment following the hearing in addition to the nine years, which could be nearly halved with time served and good behavior. Peterson ordering Blummy to have 20 years of supervised release and ordering him to enroll in sex abuse and alcohol counseling. A similar case in state court is still pending, but will likely be dismissed following the conclusion of this case. Reporting in Madison, Bill Miston, Fox 6 News.